quickly check David Dofad about her and also Speed Dalitin and Bonner Boy. So, Speed Dalitin made a video and it was kind of like also mocking Bonner Boy. But the official statement from his lawyer as of today, the official statement from his lawyer as of today, kind of like show that Speed Dalitin is regretful over what he said towards Bonner Boy. Like he's sorry, apologizing to Bonner Boy. But the video made Speed Dalitin make, it only shows Speed Dalitin apologizing or being regretful. Jempo, lawyer. So I'm going to manage this one for now. That's why I'm like, I'm going to delete that statement where my lawyer, they beg me, make a post. Because I'm going to buy a new one in the near future anyway. I posted that apology statement. Get with the phone. I'm fuck the phone. Everything in the phone is in my laptop. I lost nothing. <laughs> you understand me? I cloud and I. But before we drop it all that day, let's talk, let's talk about uh, David Doe's father, the multi billionaire. The guy just revealed that. He recently built a new power plant worth about two billion dollars. How come a David Ofada is not on the Forbes list? How come? The man who did Forbes list, but they do things of billions of dollars, billions of dollars. Forbes, see, there are some silent billionaires in this Nigeria who don't want to be known. Silent billionaires. Because of what uh, Nigerians will say. Silent billionaires. You know, we, we are still rating David O Father as below 1 billion or 1 point something billion. But this guy is a multi billionaire. He's just so calm, just so humble not to be showing it. Eh? What is it with billionaires, businessmen in this, in this country? They are so humble. They don't want to spend money on things. What is it with you that money? Okay, where did you want to use that money do? What is it with billionaires in this country? Well, let's listen to him on what he said recently that uh, David Doe himself is really, really proud of. I'm a businessman in Nigeria. I'm in the electricity business. I own um, power plants. I generate uh, presently about 15% of the electricity need for Nigeria. I have... Uh, Chinese engineering companies that work for me. I'm building almost completed by January, by the grace of God, uh, my new power plant that will be the biggest thermal plant in Nigeria. It's a 1,250 megawatts power plant will become operational in January. But during the course of the design and getting all the permits, we ran into difficult government officials for environmental reasons. Our permit was denied. The government, particular government official that I held a meeting with told me to my face that this, your project, will never see the light of day. But while he was saying that, I was saying in my mind that this guy is talking as if he's God. And because we are not God, I couldn't say it out, but I was saying it in my mind that God listened to him. Because he's not God, whatever he's, he has, whatever he's saying is null and void. I'm not going to be worried about it. So I left, disappointed of course, and I told my Chinese friend that look, unfortunately, we have these difficulties and it seems that it's going to be a while before we can get this going again. Meanwhile, you see 1,250 megawatts power plant, price tag is about 2 billion US dollars. So it's not small money. So in the process, a lot of money has already gone into design, and the preliminaries before we got to the stage where we must have the environmental um, permit before we can break ground. 
So my Chinese friend said, what are we going to do now? This is very serious because the African Bank of China was involved. And that might have you know, meant bankruptcy for him, for his company, because they have invested so much with me in, in, in this. So I told him not to worry that everything's going to be all right. And um, he said that he's worried. Do you know somebody that can take you to the president or to speak to someone? I said, don't worry about it. That everything was you know, going to be okay. And he said, are you sure? He said, no, no I'm not going to do this on, on this. On the, I'm coming to see you. It seems that you've, have, you've found a solution, so I'm coming to see you. So while on his way, I got on my knees and I prayed about it. And I asked God to make all things well. And I, so when my friend came to me face to face, he said that, yes, Mr. Chairman, um, he called me Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, so what is the solution uh, about this? It seems you are not worried. I said, I'm not worried because I've prayed about it. And God is going to make it right. My friend became very upset with me. He said, God cannot do this. So for, this is not about God now. This is not about your church. Please, Mr. Chairman, put this aside. We are talking serious issues now. <laughs> and I said, that is the only way I know to go about it. On the Sabbath, it was like on Thursday, Friday I prayed about it. On Sabbath, I prayed as, as I always do. Long story short, eh? long story short, he's going to commission that project this January 2025. We have just November, December, January, three months, three months, commission the project. And this is what David o immediately wrote. David o said, David o wrote, he said, Remember the Sabbath day, amazing testimony from my hero, my father. Then Governor Adelike said, Proud of my big bro, always, Mr. Chairman. Our parents always taught us to take everything to God in all that we do. I hope this testimony inspires others not to give up when faced with those trying to stand between them and their goals. This is why I dance to praise God. You hear that? For those of you who are saying, dancing senator, he has told you the reason why he's dancing. Go and tell the likes of uh, whiskey. <laughs> who they say they are no trade senator. Well, no, that statement was bad, though. Was bad. No? But then, pray. A businessman is telling you God exists. You see some people may they just make small, 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 small millions. They will tell you, say, God, no, they exist. Prayers, no, they work. Person may be multi-billionaire. See, they tell you, say, God, they exist, too. But some people, somewhere, 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 that they just touch money, touch small, small, small money, they will tell you, say, prayers, no, they work. God has taught us eh, to back our ideas with prayer. The only time in prayer know they work, and when you sit down for your house, you know they do nothing, you they pray. Prayer no go work. God has also told us prayer no go work. Back your ideas with prayers and work towards your achieving your goals. Then it will work. Hmm? Then it will work. Hmm? Then it will work. Well, you see it now. You see what is going. Me, my, I get my own testimony too. Prayers they work. Oh. <laughs> Who say prayers they work? He they whine you. He they whine you. A billionaire is telling you prayer works. Somebody who just touched fifty thousand US dollars or one million US dollars, but they tell you say prayer no they work. Okay, the day where you did. And meanwhile, you see the money maker they talk about. Even Kubana Chief is shout for the money. He said, couldn't sleep last night. 
that my in-law testimony no green me close eye. So now this kind of money day when we go still chop, this one now just one power plant to chai. Thank God, I am not a choosy. I am a thirty bg. <laughs> now David do say I cover you. No worry. <laughs> well, all those for their friend and matter though. Pray as they walk, you know. And again, I want to talk about this before I forget. For those of you who will see David do father now say chai. David do father get on you. What about my own dad? Oh, oh, you are being you are no correct. As old as you are, you have to say, what about my old dad? Where my dad be day? Where you day? Your dad don't live in life. Your dad has done little that he can. So people now, when they compare, they be do papa and their papa. go to say, ah, where my father be day? Where we going make money now? I follow the sofa. Chama, don't blame your dad. Blame yourself now because you don't grow. For a, for a, for a child to grow up and remember, say, this is papa get my That means you don't grow enough to make your own money. Our father tried. Eh? Not be everybody go be millionaire. Not be everybody go get too much money. Your own father tried to get you where you are. You understand? Appreciate him. Not be by being billionaire. The video father, yes, yeah, good for the video. But you will call you call the discriminate your own father because not be billionaire. Appreciate him. He has done he has done so much for you already. No discriminate him because of uh, this kind of thing, you understand? Don't because the only less many people will learn from this type thing that they don't go learn about the prayer part. Oh. They will learn about the father get money, oh, get money, oh, get money, oh, get money. Oh. Now only the team they will pick from there. So let's go to Speedality and Bonner Boy. According to the statement from uh, Speedality, he say Mr. Dality, aka Speedality, Acme public statement. So our clients are taking time to reflect on the event of the past few days. Deem it necessary to release this statement through its legal representative, which shall therefore serve as its official statement and comment on the event. Firstly, our client believes strongly in collaboration and healthy competition. He appreciates his colleague artistry and is confident that his colleague equally appreciate its craft. There have never been any prior discord or unresolved differences between them. Our client, whom may have come to know as a joy giver, made the video in question purely for laugh and for its entertainment value, with no intention to mileage or defame our defame for defame our client or defame. Our client was also was only exploring his comedic side. So speedality was only exploring his, his comedy side. <laughs> and while the content may have been interpreted and extreme, as extreme, it was never meant to harm or put a stain on his colleague's reputation. It did not foresee the level of public attention the video would attract. Our client, who holds his mother in the highest regard, does not condone disrespect towards mothers or women in general. Now, Lyle, act with the disrespect women, they measure guests in Ashwaka Waka. He therefore confided in us that the video, which was said to have disrespected his colleague, mom, was a misrepresentation of what? When you say go and sleep with your mom, that means that means representation, okay? Or a slip of the tongue. If any remark made were perceived as disrespectful towards his colleague's mom, such comments were unintended. Our client, our client, I recognize this position as an influential member of the society and a role model as effort taking the responsibility to set a positive, a positive example. It does not condone the use of social media platform to mileage, defame, and disrespect individual, and has committed to using any influence to foster peace and set a good example moving forward. Finally, 
Our client have privately reached out to his colleague and his team in the spirit of brotherhood and extension of an olive branch and to offer further clarification in person to him. Meanwhile, Akbe make video. So the assassin that they say Akbe. So now you go be the judge. Is this guy remorseful or not? <laughs>